We're here at the city of Jerusalem. This has been the capital of Israel ever since David moved from Hebron up here almost 3,000 years ago. Jerusalem is still the capital of Israel, and it's still a bustling city today where you can walk through the streets filled with shops and homes. You can experience the rich culture of the city, both past and present. You can listen to sounds of church bells ring throughout the air. And you can even take a drink of my wife's favorite drink here in Israel, freshly squeezed pomegranate juice. So many things happened here in the Bible and so many things in the life of Jesus. But not only things that have happened here in the past, but what's going to happen in the future. And this is in Revelation 21, verse 1. It says, Then I saw a new heaven and a new earth. For the first heaven and the first earth had passed away, and there was no longer any sea. I saw the holy city, the new Jerusalem, coming down out of heaven from God, prepared as a bride, beautifully dressed for her husband. And I heard a loud voice from the throne saying, Now the dwelling of God is with men, and he will live with them. So this is what's going to happen in the New Jerusalem, the dwelling of God with men. And this is the place, this old Jerusalem, where God chose to have his name rest.